For while Watergate may represent betrayal of public trust, it also represents a reaffirmation of the independence of our courts, a reaffirmation of the equal status of our Congress, and a reaffirmation of the dedication to the pursuit of truth by our press. Good to see you. Nice to see you. Very good. My district and raise his hell That shows a good demo. Well, we don't like you retreating on dental well, what, what care and those things. Is dental care's in it. Yeah, but not not adequate. Senator, how are you? Nice to see you. Good to see you. I've never Senator. asked anyone for an autograph. Sure. But I need two. I have a son named Patrick, and he is six years old, and I brought him a turtle. And that turtle just walks all over the house. Usually turtles don't walk, do they? And this turtle just walks every place. What do you know about that? And he eats hamburger, too, which is... <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, he's a... How are you? Glad to see you. How are you? Nice to see you. Nice to see you. How are you? Very, very nice to see you. How are you? Nice to, nice to see you. I think health care is sufficiently important uh, uh, to guarantee such a, uh, a right. Working uh, with the, the best that we have in the medical profession and working with uh, some role for the private, uh, the private industry. That's the kind of a program that we've adopted. But unless if you have a person that's too sick, uh, then the right to speech, uh, the right to religion, uh, even the right to the press is, is not a, a right that's going to be realized. You have to have decent quality health to be able to enjoy the most basic rights, and that's what we're attempting to do. Healthcare in this country uh, uh, issue. The voice that was raised against the violation sure of human rights. Are, are in the largest in Brazil. The largest in the northern part of Brazil. We have the highest rate of inflation in the history of the nation. We have the highest unemployment in my part of the country in the last 10 years. Indians whose rights have been exploited in the western part of this nation. And I've spoken for the voiceless people of South Vietnam. The 235,000 children that have lost arms and legs. Jack, I'll see you later. later. Thanks an awful lot. Good to see you. Thanks a lot. Appreciate it.